what is John Rawls's justice as fairness? Hi, I'm Ronald. I'm a lawyer, advocate, thinker, tutor, writer, and speaker. In this brief, we examine one distributive justice theory by John Rawls, justice as fairness. His theory proposes to reconcile two competing values of equality and liberty. The first main problem is that individuals inevitably conflict when exercising their respective freedoms. The other main problem is that in reality, humanity is plagued with inequalities of the human condition and resources. Equality is in theory a good thing, but to what extent? Strict equality would require every individual to have the exact same resources, but that would be inconsistent with the principle of liberty. John Rawls's theory therefore attempts to address these problems. His theory is a social contract theory, which may be summed up in two principles. Each person is to have an equal right to a fully adequate scheme of equal basic liberties consistent with a similar scheme of liberties for others. And second, that social economic inequalities are permissible only if they satisfy two conditions. First, that inequalities are attached to offices and positions open to all under conditions of fair equality of opportunity. And second, they must be to the greatest benefit of the least advantaged members of society. Some key principles of this theory are, first, that society is a fair system of cooperation. Second, the basic assumption that individuals are free and equal. Third, there must be a well-ordered society. There's a tension between pluralism of personal aims and societally accepted core principles of justice, and that there must be therefore overlapping consensus of political conceptions of justice. Next, a th this theory is only regarding the basic structure of a just society. It does not propose comprehensive doctrines of what cons constitutes a good and just life, uh, good and just goals. This one key premise of this theory is the original position, a veil of ignorance, a sort of a thought experiment that he uses. He imagines that if we were to uh, assume that we do not know what station of life, what kind of social economic circumstance that we will be born into, then under this veil of ignorance, what kind of society, basic structure of society do we want to have? And finally, John Rawls emphasizes public justification, a process of engagement as opposed to engagement with regard to uh, fixed substantive outcomes to be advocated. And that is John Rawls's Justice as Fairness. Be smart, be brief.